Today on D3, I'll be showing you how to replace a laptop hard drive. Now you might want to do this for a variety of reasons, perhaps to upgrade it to a solid state drive, or perhaps you, like me, just need to go ahead and replace a bad hard drive in your laptop. Now not all laptops are the same, however I will show you the most common way of doing it. Before doing anything, absolutely be sure that your laptop is unplugged and that you have removed the battery. Now we're going to try to locate the door that will allow us access to the hard drive. And this is going to vary between laptops. Some laptops, this is very simple, like mine, where you just open up, there's just two screws holding a door in place. However, some other laptops will actually make you go ahead and take apart the whole chassis. So what you'll need to do is check your owner's manual to see exactly where you can get at the hard drive. Now you should be able to go ahead and just remove the door and have full access to the hard drive. Uh, now you might see other components such as the RAM. Uh, however, ignore all of that and just pay attention to something like this. It's going to be roughly this size. Um, of course, they all will look different. Um, but once you've located the hard drive, it's a fairly simple procedure. On this laptop, to get the hard drive, it's fairly simple. All you need to do is just pull up and remove this little blue bumper. And then you'll see that there is only one screw holding the entire assembly in place. So let's just undo that. Once you are sure that all the screws have been removed, you should find some small pull tab. Now all you're going to need to do is apply some fairly firm pressure, and there you go, the hard drive will slide right out. Now all that remains is to remove the screws that hold the hard drive in the bracket. Now on this one you will see that there are four screws, two on this end and two on this end. So all we need to do is just remove these and the hard drive should be free. Now all that remains is to go ahead and apply a little bit of pressure to the hard drive to remove it from the bracket. Now keep the bracket, you will need this for the new hard drive. However, now we're all done, we've got the hard drive out, and then all you need to do is do these steps in reverse to put the new hard drive in the bracket and slide right back in your laptop. 